Good morning everyone and welcome back to a Monday with Mum session. Today is Monday 26th of July and there's little Edison. Oh what you got? Crisps. Edison's eating crisps for his breakfast today. He's been a bit um like a bit poorly not poorly but he's he's had this chest infection which you probably know about. Um, and he's been like a little bit off his food, but I don't know whether it's like the heat or him not feeling great. So um, this morning when he said he wanted crisps, I was like, yeah, have crisps for your breakfast if you'll eat something. So he's not like really been eating breakfast or lunch at the minute. Dinner is not too bad with, but um, yeah, I just sort of want to get anything into him at the minute. So he can have crisps for breakfast if he wants that. It's like about maybe nine o'clock. So we're actually expecting Adam's mum in a minute she's gonna come and paint the walls outside so adam's probably updated you on the garden but um if i just show you this is the current situation which is actually loads better than than it has been it's like really coming on now so i'm really impressed with these slabs it's just like this little bit here now left to do in the steps over there you know slab steps but this wall here and the back wall there are going to be painted gray and then that that garage door there which is next door's garage it's going to be repainted white because you can see there that's the level the garden was at the back before we leveled it so it's like all mud and stuff here like permanently stained mud so um yeah we're going to paint this but the next door said we can go to town on it basically and paint it like any color that we want so i think we're going to go white but then put like multicolor hand prints on it or like draw some like rainbows stuff like that for the kids i think they'll like that and then when they're older then we'll just paint <laughs> paint over it so it's not so so kiddy. He's, he's got his um his ball pit balls out. He's got his slime. This is his new thing now. So uh he loves play doh but recently he's just got into I don't know whether you can see that. He's just got into slime. It says jokes and gags twist slime. And this was I think it was a pound from Asda the other day and I got two bottles of it and he loves it. Like one of the bottles was blue <laughs> originally and the other one was purple and he's mixed them all together and now they've made green oh your crisps yummy are you okay today you're feeling okay his um party's still not going very good he's had like maybe two or three wees this morning and one of them was just in his pants um so i think it's going to be a case of taking months forever than weeks but that's fine anyway um there's emma She's supposed to be having a nap, but I put her down about five minutes ago and she's woken up and she's currently chewing her chewing her hands. So I go get her in a minute. And what else are we doing today? Oh so doing a tough tray activity today and our learning topic this week is farm. So fun at the farm. So I'm gonna do like a big sensory table with um all like edible things like like crushed Weetabix for the straw and um you know like bits of cereal and pasta and stuff like that for him to like mess around in and then if he wants to eat it that's a bonus um emma can probably like have a little have a little play in there as well um and then we'll probably be having early baths after that and then for the rest of the week i'm going to do like craft themed farm not craft farm themed craft activities so here he's still got all of his weather bits and bobs up but i'm going to get rid of not get rid of them but take them down today and i'm going to buy a folder each for them like a proper art folder for all their all their stuff because up here it's a bit messy at the minute but it's like all edison's um stuff that he's made before like a little flamingo with his footprint there he's got like a penguin at the back a wreath um all stuff that like i can't really fit up here so i'm going to keep i'm keeping this for like the weekly themes so this will be all like farmyard things this week up here on display oh you want slime do you um so yeah i'm gonna get get them each a folder and put all their put all their crafty bits in that we do and then i can show them when they're older then yeah so adam's mum's just turned up to do the painting so um she's outside there i'm sure she won't mind me filming but uh yeah she's out there out there doing her painting she's gonna paint the paint the garage wall first and then i think maybe try the back wall um but it's sunny like so I don't really think we should paint, paint when it's sunny because it might just like dry really unevenly or just dry a lot quicker than usual. Um, so yeah, she's out there 
It's been a very helpful painting. Um, Emma's down here on her mat having a little kick. You're all dressed now as well. Edison, what are you doing? Yeah. Oh, you're doing, you're going in your cars, yo. Oh. So yesterday, I, or Saturday it was, I organised all this. Uh, it used to be here, so I've moved it in here. Um, just like a better place for it in the playroom. And it's got all, like, the bits and bobs in each, each individual drawer. I don't know how long that will last. <laughs> Probably not very long, but it's just easy for me, because when I'm doing my custom activities, like, the stuff for that week, like the farm stuff, you know, is in there. And then, like, all this paint stuff's in there and colouring, blah, blah. And Emma's toys as well are all in one place now. Ooh. Yeah, Edison's already moving the cars to the tough tree. You playing with your slime still? This is disgusting, this stuff. But he loves it. It's like, ugh. He's been on the carpet several times as well. Me and Adam were saying that once Emma's potty trained as well, in like a couple of years, we're gonna get a new carpet and also a new sofa because as you can imagine, um, potty training, little children, it just goes everywhere. So um, either put like waterproof mats down everywhere <laughs> or just get a new carpet <laughs> at the end of it. Um, yeah, we're not, we're not like massively bothered about uh, the carpet or the sofa to be honest. Um, we probably should be a bit more house proud but we're very like um, go with the flow with the kids like there's nothing we're massively precious of in this house so it's never an issue like if Edison spills something or you know breaks something or whatever like when we bought this house we we knew that we wanted kids and this was going to be a family house so this is why it's like quite um, child friendly <laughs> like our living room has pretty much been taken over by um, the children, but that's fine, that's how we like it. What's wrong, pumpkin? What's wrong? What are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, you want to do that? I know, it's broken, isn't it? We got, I don't know what this is, but um, I think I got this free in a magazine, but it's really good. It's I know, it's broken, but this, um, it used to like, you press this and it used to pop forward with a car on it and it'd go miles, but I don't know what's happened, it's broken. I know, I'll have to try and try and either buy you a new one or try and fix it later. Um, yeah, so on that note as well, like, <laughs> please excuse the state of this. Oh, chicken, is it a boo-boo? Come here. Yeah, um, as you can probably tell, I don't take any pride in my appearance. Um, I used to. I used to wear makeup. I used to do my hair really nice. Um, I used to get nice clothes. But, oh, bless you. Um, again, since we've had kids, I just do not have time. Like, all my time goes on these two. Um, especially at the minute, like, I'm quite into crafting and, like, learning with Edison and etc. Um, so I just do not have time to sit down and do my makeup every day. I also don't, I work from home as well, so, um, no one sees me really. <laughs> Apart from, like, sometimes on Zoom calls and not on the minute because I'm on maternity. But, um... Yeah, I don't really like need have a need for makeup at the moment. Um, not that I'm saying like I don't need it, but I just can't be bothered basically. And I don't know where it is. Sorry, Ed, someone needs to be picked up. He keeps saying out instead of up for pickup. See up, up, up. That's it. Yeah. So um, we went out with our friends the other day, and I thought, oh, I'm gonna put a bit of makeup on, like make a bit of an effort because we don't really go out like without the kids very much. Um, couldn't find it anywhere like <laughs> managed eventually to find some foundation which I think is about five years old um put that on it's the wrong shade for my face <laughs> so I left it on anyway in the end um I couldn't find mascara or uh like lipstick or anything like that so I literally just went out with a bit of foundation on um which I put managed to put on my eyelashes and didn't have any mascara so my eyelashes look blonde and like non-existent um but yeah it doesn't matter like <laughs> I really really don't care what I look like um yeah, as you can probably tell in vlogs. Uh, mum life, you know, hair on top of head, big baggy pyjama top most of the day. But I get like messy a lot with Edison doing crafting and stuff, so it's probably better that I'm not wearing like really nice clothes. Hopefully like in the future I might, um, <laughs> I might go back to my old ways and get my nails done occasionally. Um, but yeah, for the moment we just prioritise the children and like all my spare money as well for makeup and clothes and whatnot goes on them. Um, which I really don't mind because I love buying new toys, toys and crafting things, especially crafting things. So uh, yeah, on that note, I think I'm going to do a bit of prep for my farm table later. So uh, we'll come a bit back on a bit later. Hello, I'm talking really quietly because Emma's asleep over there and Edison's asleep upstairs. 
but I'm putting the tub tray together now for the farm theme. So I just wanted to show you what I'm using. So it's going to be predominantly cereal based. So I'm going to use all these different cereals and then I got a couple of books there, like learning books, little sheep, shape sort of thing. And then another book over there for us to read and his farm animals and the actual farmhouse and then little bits of sample grass things. So uh, this is the before and then and this is the after. So he's got his, I added a little truck that I found as well in a toy box. So there's like little animals everywhere. I don't know what that is. That's a pig. The sheep in the in the hoops. <laughs> and then I got his little books. I've got some grass from the garden as well. I thought it made it a bit more authentic. And then two more little books there. The cows in their field. And then his little house. And this is a little oh, he's falling over. It's a dog. It's a farmer's dog. Whoop. Yeah, so all this stuff here is stuff I had in the house. So um other than that farm animals which I bought, but I wanted to buy them anyway. Um, which were like five ninety nine from the range. Everything else is just stuff that I had in the house. So it's not really cost me much at all to do this. Yeah, I'm quite pleased with that. I'm sure Edison will absolutely love that as well. So that's, it's like 12 o'clock now. So that's all set up ready for him. Emma's woken up. She's in her jumper room. <gasps> Hello, princess. Hello, princess. Hello. Do you like it in there? Do you like it? I'm going to make a cup of tea for myself. And then probably will be time to get Edison up and let him play with his surprise. That's what we call it. Whenever I do a tough tray, we call it a surprise. So uh, I told him he'd be having a surprise today. So we'll be looking forward to that when he wakes up. So yeah, I'm just gonna have my cup of tea now and uh, we'll come back on when Edison's awake. In other news, um, Adam's mum's left and she has painted the back wall and the garage wall and it looks so, so good. So let me show you. Actually, <laughs> I don't even tell on the camera, but it's like a really light grey and it looks so like clean and tidy. I'm so pleased with it. And the poor thing, she was out there in like the baking hot sun. So I feel a bit sorry for her, but she come back tomorrow to do another coat maybe? Did she say another coat? Or oh, she's gonna start oh no she's not gonna start the big wall. Um she's gonna come back and do another another coat. Um but yeah it looks it looks so nice. I think it looks nicer in like off camera um but yeah hopefully you can see the difference because i showed you this morning when it was all like pasty like cement color and i quite liked that actually but um this is is so nice we just need to give the top of the wall a bit of a clean i think as well um, but yeah i'm so so pleased with that so thank you to adam's mum i know she watches these so very much appreciated um it's a little while later as well and I've not had my cup of tea. I think this is going to be a recurring theme for my videos. Trying to get a cup of tea all the way throughout the day and then not getting one. Because of you. Because of you and your brother. Just you at the moment though. Edison's still asleep although he has coughed a few times so I don't think it'll be long before he wakes up. So he's awake and he's gone straight, straight to the tree and it's gone straight in his mouth. Let me have a look, what are you eating? You're supposed to play with it, not eat it all. Mm. Do you like it? What is it? It's the farm. Whoa, Edison. What have you got in there, look? Who's in there? Who's that? Cow. Cow, good boy. Cow. They're in their field, aren't they? What else have we got? Nice crispy. I knew this would happen, Edison. Right, what's this here? Should we see what we got here? Sheep. It's a sheep, good boy. Oh, a sheep. Edison, are you gonna play with it? Oh. Have a play then, if you have a play. Oh, how about the tractor? Oh. The tractor. It's hungry, are you?
So Edison's decided that his sensory table is actually a grazing table. He's just sat here eating it all. We did read the books though, didn't we? And you like the books. The Susan the Sheep? Chloe the Cow? Hmm? Yeah, Susan Sheep and Cow. Yeah, he liked, he did like the books, but as you can see, it's like quite in, <laughs> intact still, because he doesn't really want to play with it, he just wants to eat it all. Um, but I've showed him all the animals, and we've gone through what noises they make. So he's learning, <laughs> but um, yeah, I think, I don't know, maybe there's like a bit too much going on for him, or maybe he'll probably just come back to it later, I think. And then we've got Emma over here moaning. I think she's coming down with a cold. So, oh precious, you're not well. Oh dear, it's okay. I know, Mummy will come and sit with you. Really difficult with two of them sometimes when I'm trying to like do stuff with Edison and teach him things and I need to spend time with him to do that. Um, and then Emma's like, obviously she's so little still and she does need a lot of attention and she doesn't sleep as much as she used to now. So um, <laughs> I'm very lucky if they sleep at the same time. Which they did, they did today for about maybe 45 minutes while I set that, that tough tree up. So that was good, but um, yeah, I feel a bit bad for Edison sometimes because I, I do have to spend a lot of time with Emma. Like, parents of two or more children will probably feel the same way, but um, yeah, it's, it's hard sometimes to like give them both the same attention and um, poor Edison, because he's older. <laughs> I think he gets a little bit less attention, but I do make sure like I spend time with him in the day as well and um, I have to just like grab all those moments while Emma's asleep but yeah like I said today she's really fussy because I don't think she's feeling great so I do have to like sort of keep sitting with her and I think probably why Edison's like not massively involved in his table today <laughs> but I think he'll come back to it later and I'm going to leave it set up for the day because I want to show Adam as well. Um, but yeah, I think I think it has been a success. I've enjoyed it anyway. Um and yeah, we'll just see see what the rest of today brings. I think we'll just do some like reading and books and stuff cuz um I've got crafting things planned for the next few days. He's gone back for a play and another Weetabix. Oh, what are you doing? You're putting the chickens on the tractor. Are they going for a ride. A ride. A ride. Good boy. Oh dear, Emma's crying. Uh oh. You're enjoying it a bit more now, aren't you? He's definitely enjoying his Weetabix. So he's now decided he wants to throw it everywhere into his eyes. And then he's just come over to me. Oh god, Edison. Complaining that his eyes are itchy. That's because you've got porridge in your eyes, Edison. You've got porridge in your eyes. And your hair. Definitely having a bath in a minute. We're having a bath and then we'll do story times, okay? This little one is not feeling well at all. Poor thing, she feels a bit hot. Don't think she's got a temperature, but she just feels warm. And literally every time, every time I get up off the sofa to go and see Edison, she screams, like not even crying, like absolute screaming, like she's being murdered. Hey. Yeah, she's not. She's not 100%, poor thing. We're all done now with our tough tree activity. This is the current situation. It's like all over the floor. All over the floor in here. I can hear Edison messing, messing more of it. So yeah, it's gonna be a massive hoover job for me. Yeah, I think he's had a good time though, haven't you? Did you have a good time? Do you like it? Yay! Nanny, yeah, Nanny, Nanny was here before, wasn't she? It's at her house now. Yeah, so I'm just gonna clean all this up and then I think we might, oh my gosh, Edison, no, uh, I think we might put some water in the tray and some bubbles and give them all the best. I just wanted to say as well, um, obviously like I've used a lot of food on this table, but it is um, stuff that was like coming towards the end of its sell by date and I have kept a lot of it in this container here. So I've just stored it all in there because it makes really good um, like sand and stuff like that for other activities that we'll be doing because we'll probably do like a beachy themed one at some point. Um, so I'll reuse it for that. And then he does um, he does tough trace a lot with his diggers like scooping and 
dig in and like carry and things so it's really good for stuff like that as well so i'll definitely keep keep a lot of it so i'm not i'm not wasting it or anything like that so we're all tidied that literally took 40 minutes maybe so maybe we won't do that one again um it was like the porridge because it was just everywhere like like a cloud um so yes perhaps we won't do that one again uh there it is all well i need to wipe down but it's all cleared anyway floor's clear finally it's all clear in here but i'm honestly about to have a meltdown now i'm so hot and Emma's like only just stopped crying. She just she's been crying on and off all day, like an absolute just nightmare. Like I know it's because she's not feeling well. It's not her fault, obviously. But oh god, honestly, I'm so drained. Um, Edison's been a nightmare the past, like since we stopped doing this tough tray, probably for like an hour or so. It's just been an absolute nightmare. Just so naughty, like getting into everything, pouring everything out when I'm trying to tidy up. Um, just abnormally naughty and then on top of Emma screaming and like me trying to clear up and Edison walking through all the porridge like that I've just sweeped into a pile and then walking it all the way through where I've just hoovered oh god honestly kids eh I've still not had a cup of tea either I think that's adding adding to my problems today and my mood because I just really need a cup of tea so maybe I'll try and have my cup of tea now I think it's like I don't even know half three plus Possibly half three. So Adam will be back soon, which will be very nice. But then he's probably had a really hard day in work as well, so he'll be exhausted. <laughs> oh well. So I've just come in the kitchen and found a big wee on the floor. Cheers, Edison. Cherry on top of my day, that is. Cheers. Mmm, cheers. Whoa! Bubble machine's on. Keep Edison occupied while I'm. Tidy in the kitchen. Ooh, <gasps> what is it? More bubbles? Adam's due home any minute now. It's about quarter past four. So he can watch watch Edison while I put tea on. You've had a banana, haven't you? We got bubbles. Wow. I think it's running out a little bit. We need to put some more stuff in. Yeah. More bubbles. There's the gorgeous girls. <coughs> Hello, princess. Hello. You're beautiful. Yeah. So yes, I'm home. And I know my mum's been here painting, so I'm sure Daniel's vlogged this, but let's have a look. Oh, wow. Looks nice and clean and fresh. Even the grey wall at the back looks really good. Uh, the garage is also grey. She, I came out and she's like, what colour do you want in the thing? And I liked the grey, so I said, oh, let's try the grey. It's, it's white though. No, it's green, but is it's the same colour as the back wall. Yeah. Oh well, it looks white to me, but it looks really good. Yeah, it all sort of blends in and matches in now. And then it's just this wall and the dang, the whole bottom area to paint now. But thank you very much, Mum. <laughs> this little one's do a bottle now. And you miss it, you're a hungry girl. Yeah, I saw that uh, Daniel sent me pictures anyway. They're doing farmyard. Well, farms today, farmyard animals and stuff like that and whatnot, and they had a tractor out, right? so looks as though they had a lot of fun, didn't they? But, um, yeah, apparently Edison's been a naughty boy today, so I don't know what he's done, and maybe he's, maybe it's all the footage is on here now, and I'll uh, see all as I'm editing it, but uh, he'll probably be a good boy now, I'm home. I'll get him in line, <laughs> or Emma will. We'll put him in line together, won't we? Yeah. Yeah, I'm just gonna make tea now, really. Not gonna do a lot. Play with the kids. It is a nice day outside today, but um, tomorrow is meant to be sort of raining from then onwards. So we're gonna have several days in a row, I think, of rain. I don't know whether it's like constant rain every day or whether it'll be like drizzly for parts or, or whatnot. But uh, yeah, there's the uh, there's the drain again outside. It looks so good. It's blending so well. That's uh, Yep, a little bit left to do right there. Have you just had your bottle, Mrs? Are you all full up now? Yes, you are. You're all full up. Oh, it's been being full up. We've got tea soon, so we'll just have an oven food tonight. We have a food shop coming tomorrow, and Edison's having a little mini pizza. He's been asking for pizza today, so he's having that. 
But um, yeah, we're not really going to do a lot today, so I'm probably just going to end the vlog here. Or Danielle will. And with that, I do, I do, I.